Hello and welcome back to Steel Division 2. We are playing Germany in the Orsha campaign and so far there is no sign of a collapse of Army Group Center. Au contraire, we have crushed the Russian attacks one after the other time, destroyed countless numbers of units so far. Well, that's a little bit of exaggeration, but in last battle we actually were managed to destroy um, both a Josef Stalin regiment and an ISU-122 regiment. So we can be pretty optimistic as of now. But this battle th now will be somewhat more challenging, I think, because we will face very high numbers of enemy attackers. And I have no idea how that works, but it tells me basically that five units are attacking. Um, even though I think only three can, maybe it just tells me that those five, one of those five or some of those five m might be the ones that attack. I have no idea. Um, the question is now what to do. I don't have anti-air support here. There is no flak unit blocking them. None of these units here that is available in phase A has anti-air equipment. None at all. These guys, these have some, but they are in phase C, so they would might arrive too late in the war. So it seems like a good choice to actually deploy some fighters, to bring them in the first time. The thing is they are... I have a lot of them. And, um, I mean, with their cannons, they can't destroy um, heavy tanks, even though the 30 millimeters should probably, if attacked from behind, they might actually be able to, to, to um, penetrate it. I have no idea how that, whether that works in the game too, but in reality, they would be able to crack most tanks open, though this one seems to be not attacking anyways. So it seems like a good choice to bring in those fighters. And now I can either de decide to bring in more bombers to attack potential artillery threats. I mean, they don't have that much, but they have a lot of mortars and the mortars are dangerous enough. And those are, no, those are anti-tank guns. Yeah, the mortars are dangerous enough. So in this regard, um, that they only have a few here. Is, it seems that it's only one 122 gun left. But if I spot them with the fighters, I should be able to strafe them. So in this regard, I think it's fine. Um, question is, do I set up an artillery unit? What do they have? One 105s? Czech ones. Okay, interesting. And those are heavy 150s. And those are 100. Um, aren't those from Skoda? So basically originally Czech as well? I have no idea, to be honest. Um, artillery isn't really my specialty. So I could either bring this, like bring a lot of mortars. That's a full-blown another infantry division and it's dug in, so I shouldn't use it. Either more artillery, I guess, or I bring, do they have anti-tank guns? They do, ooh, they have 88s, but only three of them. That is interesting, 88s, okay. Or I bring more bombers. Do they have anti-air? Checked. Let's check this real quick. I don't think any any one of those can attack. But it seems none of these units, they have anti-air. In case you should bring them, that would be an issue. Okay. But I don't see um, the defensive circle, so they shouldn't. They shouldn't be deployed and blocking me like this, like you see the circle here. And accordingly, if I bring in. The dive bombers, I should be fine. 
Difficult. I got enough fighters basically. Let's bring in let's bring in artillery. The only question is the one with the anti tank guns or not. Oh, they have anti tank shells, okay. So they are at least somewhat useful against tanks. 22s, ooh, 220s, I mean, 22 centimeters, that sounds quite dangerous. Let's actually try the artillery unit, whatever, let's go for it. We're taking manual control of all units and go for the battle. Okay, what kind of map is this? Ah, it's this one again. Okay, so we need to move units forward here to hold it. We need to hold this. Yeah, but basically the front line is set already. This seems like a nice position for support. Do they have like infantry guns? No, they only have anti-tank guns. I could set up um, a gun point here just in case that they send something heavier than than um, I don't know armored trucks but let's get see so okay let's start with the fortifications 75 actually we put a 75 turret up here bunker up here um, that's great flanking position um have to put in trenches here I'll try to put the other one on the other flank maybe how about here why not how far is north can they shoot from there it's actually quite a lot yeah, let's do this, like that. Okay. Mm. Would be nice to be able to strafe down here and also defend against a potential push over this here, but that doesn't seem to be the right position for this. Okay, let's um, put a... Do we want one here? I mean, it's it's mostly going to be infantry, so machine guns are probably more important. Unless I find positions where the packs can flank fire and destroy advancing units again. And we could try this with another, like, 37 here. And, um, okay, so this one has a nice field of fire, at least, to some degree. Probably having one here would also be really useful. And, um, I don't know, one here? Oh wait, we have like bushland here. That's a nice position for another anti-tank gun. I think. Yep, that should be able to fire neatly into the flank. Machine guns, let's put one here in the center. It's either back there or somewhere flanking. I don't, as usually, I t say this often enough, I don't like to put them in the first line. That seems to be a good position for some th something at least. This here is nice. Whatever comes down here and we'll put infantry into those buildings. 
and then they have support fire from the back. And I don't think I need an anti-tank on here because there is nothing going to advance unless they suddenly have tanks. And for those, we can actually put up a five centimeter in case something is coming down and getting spotted that anti-tank gun might dis might be able to destroy it we've got two more machine gun bunkers so i would like to have one somewhere here supporting this and one somewhere here i guess um, because here i'll have my defensive line up up here in front and whatever i can have here is not close enough to support so it's useless to put it there anyways we've got a machine gun here now i want infantry in here and in here probably so i don't know here maybe somewhere is there some what is their range 1500 right yeah so if i put them in here hmm i mean it could have a bigger range but it's probably going to survive for much longer and thus have a higher impact let's actually try this and another one, I don't know, we could put it up here at 1500 range, but that's a little short in case they're coming somewhere here. I don't know, is there any raised position here? That's too far away. Well, that's nice for a pack, I think. I don't know what could they what could be there to be shot at, but if something breaks through, if they have like a douche car or something, that puck could finish it. So we've got the machine gun here for flanking fire. We need one somewhere here. No, no, somewhere here. Yeah, like this. Whatever. Not ideal, but I think I'm not sure we can put some up something better. We can also put uh, an anti-tank gun, or should we put a five centimeter here? I think we're gonna put a five centimeter here, because if something comes down and is getting shot at, it's gonna be from the front, and then we want a little more penetration than the 37 can of offer. Okay, we've got one anti-tank gun, we actually got two here. There's a machine gun in here, and I don't know, we could put, yeah, let's put another 37 here. We mustn't forget to set them all then in, um, in the efficient shot mode. Anywhere else where we could shoot at an approach, we have two packs here, that should be enough. To shoot at this, it's basically impossible, or we have to put it in the front line. So not, not much we could do here. This is a machine gun, right? So we could put a 50 up here and shoot if something drives down here. I don't think they'll, well, they won't they will unload before this, so we should keep this in mind as a potential position. We've got another pack here, another pack here. I don't think it makes any sense other than putting it here. Yeah, we're gonna do it here. So, I don't know, like this? Okay, that should be fine. Okay, um, I want a gun pit up here. Um, let's put another gun pit up here. I don't know what I'm gonna put into this, but um, might be of some use. Uh, let's put one up here, can we? I don't know. Oh, we can put one here. Okay. Fine too. This is raised? It is. Okay. So how about here? Too bad we don't have infantry guns. That would be nice for infantry guns. Okay, let's um, do the defenses. Okay, let's start on the left flank with the first company. Um, we'll send a commander forward and I don't know how many one, two, one, two, three, four and is there any chance for a good machine gun position? 
unless I, I don't know, I run into the trees somewhere, I don't know. It's really... Like this seems to be a decent position. 1,500. Yep, so they can shoot over down here. The only question, the only point is he's gonna mortar that as soon as he can. But we have four of them, so I think we can afford losing one early on. So you're going to unload here. You're going to unload. Unload here. Unload. That is Y, right? Yep. Unload here. Unload here. This is a little... The trees is a little problematic. They're getting... They will get in so close. What do they have? No, they don't have like um, flamethrowers or something like that would be nice. Um, I need mortars then for support and having recon up there would be nice as well. So yeah, let's put a Spätrup here. He's going to unload at this position and then move forward and um, have hold his fire. But we'll have to pay a lot of attention that he doesn't um, get overrun there. I think four infantry squads should be enough especially with mortar support, which will come soon. Um, but I think they need to defend this as well. So... This has a good field of fire. Let's put a machine gun in here. This has a decent one. And more approaches, I think. Yeah, let's put another machine gun in here. And um, the... Wait. That wasn't supposed to be the second company. It's the first. My OCD again to uh, make sure the right companies are being used. Okay, and you guys unload. Hansa Grenadier, I don't know. You go here. 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 Um, I don't think I'm gonna need Panzerschreck. The only question is, am I going to put like recon here? Do they have like a raised building? No. Could put them in here. Yeah, let's put some in here. Okay. Um, yeah, this area is second company. So, machine gun here, um, how about here, yes, we put a trench here, and another machine gun into that one. Answer Grenadier, I don't know. So this has mm, yes yeah, some flanking fire over there, but not much. I don't think it's worth putting a machine gun in there. So I don't know. Like uh, like this maybe. And um, yeah, let's leave it for this. For um, let's leave it at that for now. And those guys can go in here and unload. And I want a recon unit up here in the trees and hopefully being able to see something. Um, are they going? Yeah, I think they also need to defend this. So let's put up a trench here. Two grenadier units, another trench here, more grenadier, a trench in front of this. machine guns here 
think we need a machine gun in here. Let's put one in here. Second company. This seems a little weak. Um, what if I put... Well, I don't think that's... Yeah, the trees are too high at blocking them, unfortunately. Uh, could put a trench in here, I guess. Yeah, let's put one in here and another machine gun. Oh, I can't put a trench in here, okay. This field of fire here isn't too big. Yeah, let's hope the artillery support and the flanking fire will be sufficient to hold them. Now those guys, um, like basically spreading them around. Like I'm gonna put some trench in through the trees here with um, Panzergrenadiere. Did it work? Where is the trench? I don't see a trench. Okay, there it is. This would be a nice view. No. Can somebody climb on there? Probably not. But if it were possible, that would be a nice position. And I think I'm just gonna put a trench back here with more machine guns. Um, this, these buildings in front, that is a little dis uncomfortable. I'd either have to like, I either have to push in here, but if I have this, I should also fight for this. Or I'll have them right in front of me. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Yeah, and there's not much, not many positions I can put someone where the machine gun is or has a justified position. Here, maybe. That is really a small area that he can fire upon. And I don't like this. Are well, we gonna spread them out now? Führer probably somewhere in the middle and let's make sure his effect is the highest possible so let's uh, yeah there could be another machine gun in here so let's group some around him Schwere company okay we can set up heavy mortars which will long range in the back and that might actually be a good choice okay and then we have some more um, or we can... Nah, it's, I think it's probably wiser to just go for the heavy, really heavy artillery. Wait, where? I'm confused. Didn't I just set up mortars? Where are they? Am I blind? Ah, no. There they are. Oh yes, I'm blind, by the way. <laughs> so yeah. Um, I think I'm gonna s just put the artillery in the back here. These are able of direct fire, so we're not gonna use them. 150 is really heavy artillery. So maybe here into the trees. And um, here. And I don't know. Here. No, wait. Let's take them away and give us... Do we have recon? I don't think so. Yeah, it's only fighters. Air yeah, recon. There we have one. Okay, let's start with a recon plane. Should we? Yeah, let's start with a recon plane. And um, we have artillery oh. here. I think we're set. Let's go. Um, pause, just to make sure every one of them is moving where it's supposed to. They are all unloading, they are all unloading. So are they. So is this one. These unload and those unload. 
can they buy can they reattach i don't think so okay let's check do they move here the führer doesn't okay you unload here maybe and um pack oh yeah i need to put it in efficient shot you are only on return fire efficient shot efficient shot Recon unit would have been nice here, just to make sure I see more. But I think it it should be fine. Efficient shot as well, and I think uh, we have to make sure the Aufklärer here does his job as intended. Spätrup, um, he's moving up. Unload a position. They can actually go here. Do I see any artillery as of yet? I should send the recon plane in. Let's unload. You and return fire only. Okay, I think they are pushing up here. So we should get the artillery ready. And I think those two, if I can't attach them, which seems to be the case, I can basically move them aside. Okay, yeah, let's uh, have one of you he shoot here. Oh no, here we got something. First fighter wing, I don't know, let's just go with this one and try and then try whether we can strafe something away. Let's try this. And second unit uh, isn't assigned yet, so you guys are the second. You guys can move up here. Second unit. Shoot here. So it's pinned down. Okay. Let's see. So far, no. Uh, enemy planes. A lot of artillery though. And this guy is really exposed. We need to make sure he's going to get away. And we killed it, I think. Even though I didn't see the uh, kill m message. Okay, can you guys now, like, I don't know, strafe something here? This one, you go for that one. Um, they are still shooting. After that, they could basically shoot here. Question is, is there counter battery fire? That is something we need to make sure we keep uh, an eye on. But I don't like the that the fighters are basically. Their limit, their usefulness is so limited. Okay, go for this one and then for that one, I don't know, and then for that one. Where's the second one here? Go for this one after that. He should be able to like strive something too, right? Okay, they've killed it. Studebaker, you go for 76. They are not being fired upon yet. Okay, good. Objective lost. Objective secured. Um, no, no. Okay, we killed something. Yeah, we just probably just um, set it up. Like this, and then that, and then, I don't know, just click around like crazy. Does he have... oh wait, stop. This guy. Okay, 
not, I can't select it. Where is it here? Can you go for that one? That one, maybe? Okay, this one is evacuating. Okay. In mission, that one is circling. Is he attacking something? He is. Or he's trying to. This one is also in mission. He could go for... I mean, taking out the Dushkas would be really helpful. Does he go for an attack? Okay, that was... No, that wasn't a kill. Um, do we have recon left? Yeah, not many though. Okay. Let's move them up. They are pushing up here. Okay, so artillery needs to support this. And I think I need to get the fighters in. Ah, damn it. Okay, the recon plane can go over this here. Because we really don't want to lose this flank. Um, I don't know, just shoot this mortar. In mission, that is this one reloading. Where is this one? This here? Okay, does he have something to shoot at? He's circling around rather aimlessly, it seems. So I don't know, strafe something, but strafing is really inefficient. And this seems okay. But even there, he was still able to unload. Okay, that was a nice <laughs> um, point blank hit right on top. Okay, we need to move them up. I don't see much of an option, and we need to reinforce that side. In mission, um, recon is circling here. Can you go for, I don't know, this? But I don't like this. It's really inefficient. Okay, where do we have... Um, you could go for the Studebaker. This is something we should prioritize, killing the ammo trucks. One is already pushing down here. So we need to keep this flank here and we need to support it. Um, we've got 25 more minutes. Okay, that's a long time. That's, we can probably speed it up a little. Okay, so, oh, they're charging in here. Where are my, where are my trucks? Have they been destroyed? No, there they are. Okay, um, quick hunt up here. I don't think I'll need you. Nice. So, this one needs support and as fast as possible. And this one here, I don't know, just go for this. If you can. Um, artillery, fire, fire, oh fuck. And then fire on this. Um, and on this, and let's send some ammo. Okay, 
Okay, so they are doing damage. I'm not sure whether that's such a great idea. Okay, unload. Hunt up here. And you hunt up here. I want you to, to attack. There, oh god, th this is even a road. I completely ignored that. They can come over the road directly. Okay, so I really need to enforce this flank to reinforce it. Um, Panzerschreck? I mean, it's not really armored cars. Is there any anything with a good view range? Not really. So bringing in infantry doesn't... Uh, bringing in machine guns doesn't really help. Okay, we got this one. Uh, I don't know, go for, for that maybe. Oh yeah, and this one needs to hunt forward here and then hunt up here afterwards. Second battery, fire on this. Um, I don't know, just strafe in here something. Oh, there's a Studebecker, go for it. No, you go for this one. And you go for this one. Can we mortar? Can we fire this? Yes, we can. Okay. Ah, they killed the unit. Damn it. Okay, I have no self propelled, like lightly armored something. No, I don't. That's unfortunate. So they are like the only units that can fight here and this flank is getting really weak. Um, strafe it. Should have brought the fighters on top, not, not the artillery. Ah, uh, the bombers. Yeah, they capitulated. This flank is collapsing and one is marching through here apparently. No, it's it's dwindling. I don't know what that means. Um, where are the two trucks here that I've sent forward? Probably destroyed already? No, there they are. Okay, quick hunt. Um, you can go here. Like you have machine guns, but I don't think you really have much armor. Even the sniper does damage on them. Yeah, that doesn't seem really assuring. Yeah, they are apparently fully vulnerable to 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 gunfire. Okay, you fire on this here, and you fire on that here. Oh no, fire in here. Fire on the sniper. I hate snipers. Can you hunt this one? I don't know, you hunt this one maybe? Should have had a machine gun here maybe. Unload. Okay, that was an artillery unit. Oh, they are sending in tons of forces. Um, I need to get more artillery. If I, I think that's the only choice I basically have left. Um, can I go for this one, please? I don't know. Get a new one just to make sure. And this one can, I don't know. Can you strafe the snipers? Uh, spotter over it. You can shoot this one, please. You could uh, strike this again. Okay, he's currently shooting, but he could fire after that in here. 
This flank is holding just fine. Nope, those could use some support. Okay. Let's take this, turn this, turn three. Um, fire. Fire. And fire in here. Just hammer it. Go after this one afterwards. This one. Okay. Send some ammo right there, right away, and bring in the next artillery. Yeah, this flank is collapsing. I need to really hammer it hard now with the artillery. If I want to keep them back. Um, what are the planes doing? You are going here, what are you doing? Nothing. Can you strafe this please? And you strafe, where is it here? Kill the ammo trucks. Kill them. Afterwards go for the mortar. And then for this one, and I don't know. Okay, artillery. Fire in position, fire here. Okay, this one is out of ammo. Where is it? Okay, need to get some closer. Bombard this. And you... Can you shoot this? No, he's out of ammo as well. Okay. Um, get closer and reload. Unload. This is unit 4. These two here. 4. Um, shoot this. You shoot that. And you strafe the ammo trucks. Strafe it. Strafe it. Kill it. Um, this is a truck. Kill that one if you can. Ooh, this one. Kill it. Where is it? Okay, it's now reloading. Good. Okay, fire position. Okay, so one has broken through here. Okay, do we have some infantry left that we can have charge in? No, we don't. Damn it. Commander. Yeah, we're basically out of men. So I should either, I need to either weaken another flank or have them, um, you know what, we could concentrate fire on those here. So you shoot here and you shoot here. Um, fighter, where is a fighter? This one is ready. Go for this one. And then for that one, please. Okay, we lost that unit here. They are getting bombarded hard, which is a huge problem because they are stuck so close together. So they're killing more than one whenever they shoot. Probably order them to fire at the artillery up here. And maybe have those try to strafe it. Strafe it. Where is it, by the way? Could you just go for this one, please? And then, I don't know. Just strafe yourself through here. Would be mighty nice. Hmm. 
not killed. Okay, four. Um, fire at this position, I don't care. And you fire at, what was it here? And we need to bombard this position again. And this one here. Okay. Um, we've lost that one, that is not good. Can we push forward and take it? Like you could go here and I don't know. Um, this one is not... The, they've broken through here and taken this one as well, god damn it. Okay, I need reinforcements. I guess one of those. Those are holding too, but here it's coming becoming critical. Um, can you fire? Yes, they can. Sh sh they shouldn't hit the own units with that. And you could fire. No, you can't. It's out of range. It's out of range. Interesting. No, he's out of ammo. <laughs> okay. So that one is. Oh, that one is out of ammo as well. Okay. I guess we need to bring in more ammo. Oh god damn it, I select this. Why doesn't it work? Here. No. Fire here. You fire, I don't know. Here. Oh, it. Selected another unit again. Okay, we need recon up here. Okay, so they're pushing back in here. That is not good. Where is that unit I'm pulling back? <laughs> here. Yeah, that's quite a while to go, more quite, quite a long distance still to go. Okay, we can bring those up, I guess. Quick hunt here. Maybe they are able to do some damage. And those here. I don't know. I don't think I can push through here with unarmored trucks. So maybe you just go here as well. Oh, no! You go, move fast here. Maybe you you can do some flanking fire without getting killed while trying to reach it. You could, I don't know, go here. Two. Can you bombard this place? And you... This here? No, you bombard this, this here. Shooting that on the, on the border seems like a waste as the... Uh, un unaimed shells, a lot of them will just leave the map where there can't be even, there can't even be a target. Okay, 10 more minutes. I really don't like this here. Okay, do we get it at least? Ah, yes we do. Be nice if it would be able to retreat. No, it doesn't. Never mind though. Okay, we've got recon up now. Can you just some one of you strafe this and you strafe this here maybe and then that? Uh, let's send a recon right over this here so we can see something. Okay, let's go for this first. Kill the Studebaker if you can.
Where is that fighter? Here it is. Kill it. Uh, got unspotted the very moment the um, strike went in. So everything missed. Okay, four. You could bombard this. Both of you. Let's not be frugal here. Three. You could bombard this. Maybe you take it out. You bombard this. And one. Okay. He killed it? Looks like it. But I didn't see the message. That is kind of um, annoying. What are you doing? Okay. He's still strafing that one. That is a lot of damage. One one person only left. So getting getting one of those mortars in the open is actually decently effective. Okay, so they they are pushing that back. Quick hunt. Yes, we got it. Okay, um, just stay here. We have this point back. That's fine. Don't need you to push further. Th those two are close to close close as well. I don't think I'm gonna go for them. Will he at some point kill them? Just stay and return fire. Not that you get killed here. Um, can you, I don't know, go for that one and then that one? And you go for this one as well, just to make sure. There is the... <laughs> he's now coming in, okay. Um, go in here. Artillery, you fire here. Three is still not firing. Fire here, I don't know. Or is not, no longer firing. Okay, we need to check on the ammo. They are reloading. This one still has ammo left. This one doesn't. So we can pull that one back and send a new one. Who does have ammo left? And you can get actually get a little closer, and you too. But it seems... how many HE shells? No. Okay, they need ammo occasionally. Um, we've got this one, we've got that point back. Yeah, I think the front is holding, though the losses are far higher than necessary. And the um, fighter jets are so useless that it's really frust becoming frustrating to me. Um, would have been nice if I had actually been able to kill something with them. But, yeah, I mean, getting one down now is not really too impressive if you see how many um, attacks we are flying, how often we click. The loss, the things, the number of, of units they've killed is so slow, so low. That is unfortunate. Okay, let's see whether we can find something here to attack. But they don't spot anything. Okay. And it's one minute only left. Oh, one minute only left. So we can use the artillery as much as we possibly can. Why not fire in here? All of you. There was a lot of them here. Maybe we kill something. And they could actually do a quick hunt. Forward here. For 13 seconds, okay. Probably no more kills. Anyways, still a good victory, a major victory. A little unsatisfying, to be honest. Okay, the kills are pretty decisive, though. Um, yeah, and we have our tank, anti-tank guns, once more killed a metric Arston. But let's see. Look at this. Look at this. I wonder who was that, where it's at. Too bad I didn't check.
because it would have been helpful to know the positioning. But there you see, the two, so to put up the anti-tank guns in a position where they can shoot advancing units is the best thing, not just for anti-tank role, but rather to, to wipe out whole infantry squads before they can deploy. Okay, let's see what the fight is. So this one has at least killed, oh, it killed a 76 and two, what is it, machine gun squads? That has actually killed four, artillery included. That has killed three students. I think those are like ammo trucks and a, a heavy mortar and two others. That's actually okay. And this guy, 76, heavy machine gun, heavy mortar, heavy mortar, two, two medium mortars and four Studebakers. That's pretty okay. I think I shouldn't complain this much. So the results were overall okay. I think I lost far too much here, um, which is unfortunate because that means that um, this unit probably can't fight for much longer and I need infantry resupply in the south. But overall, it went fine. So it was only those two units. No, and we destroyed a whole unit. I guess an artil artillery unit. And that's my turn now. Okay, I think I need reinforcements here. Infantry, that's that, those fronts. I mean the northern... Ooh, whoa, whoa. That it might become a, an issue. A lot of KVs. And they are pretty tough. They don't uh, even have serious anti-air here. At least they are dug in. So I guess that's something. Those are dug in. I mean, the reshuffling of the units here seem to have worked just fine, which is really nice. That was the unit. Um, yeah, 75%, 65. So we lost up to a third per company. That one will need reinforcements. And it will need not, yeah, like this at least. Let's move those up. Those we are moving up as well. And I think, where would, will I need the heavy tanks? Question is, where is a map for heavy tanks as well? I remember the first map we fought here in the north. Having heavy tanks there seems like a rather risky business. Still undecided. I should use them at some point though. Okay, we have 15 points and this is the 25th Panzer Grenadier Division. So I think we're going to reinforce them. Oh, there, it's a Panzer Battalion, okay. Stuks. So that's not really what we aimed for. We need infantry would be fine. Like this one, no, it can't be deployed there. Okay. Sturmgeschütz, Reserve, Sicherungsregiment. So those are very weak units. Yes, can they be deployed here, by the way? No, they can't. Here, down there. Okay, that will be close enough. Um, but I think we are going to look at this, what we're doing um, in the next episode. Um, once more the front held and I think we did really good damage so I hope you enjoyed it if you did so please consider following and subscribing almost every one of these battles is streamed on twitch at twitch.tv slash inclutos um, would be nice if you join the conversation there thank you for watching see you next time